Hello everyone. Welcome to TTS Power. We are a manufacturer of power line hardware. So this is the first time we use the recording to for our video. Uh, because of the internet connection, the live streaming will be will be stopped. So today we are start the recording parts of our video uh, also on uh, Tuesday and Friday two days twice a week so uh, last week we, uh, I and uh, my colleague Amanda and I also do the live streaming on Tuesday and uh, Friday today uh, it's Wednesday. Uh, we are sorry for that. We are deciding this tomorrow, uh, yesterday, so we are delaying the recording from yesterday to today. So uh, from next week, we will update our video on Tuesday and Friday. So today, what are the topics? Okay. Today's topic is on the blackboard behind my and behind me. The topic is stay alone. I will talk about stay alone and talk about things and questions in the next video. The first question that uh how you pass the how pass the house. They are what is stay alone? My group has stay alone. Can you stay alone? So now let's start our video today. So we'll see what are the stay loads. The stay load is also named stay set. It is used to connect the stay rail to the ground anchor. A stay load is major component of the pole line technology. They set a manufacturer to perform a wide range of activities in different environments and weather conditions. It is a set with a combination composing of stay plate, stay road, eye bolts, turn buckles, and nuts and cymbals. The stay set is usually made of steel as the main material taken through a number of process to give it a fine finish. But what are the main use of stay road? Stay road offer mechanical support to joint parts. They support them for clasping under extreme pressure. And about some applications. In the electrical field, it is used to stay tall structure and pole poles. In the pole line technology, different forms of stay rows are used in pole lines, distribution lines, and te telecom lines. Now, let's work. Let's have a look on different types of stay rows. The roads are divided into two main types. What are they? Oh, they are four types stay roads and the tubular type stay roads. These are four and two types. But what are they included? Four types have four small types, uh, detailed types. They are stay roads. Stay symbols, stay plate, and stay road. And also the turbulence types have two main types, including the eye stay road, turn back on stay road. And the difference between the turbulence type and the ball type is in the structure. Turbulence 
types of state laws are used in wide range in Saudi Arabia and Africa. However, both types are commonly seen and used on a wide scale in South Asia. So let's have a detailed introduce to these two types of state laws. Firstly, four types. Stable is a type of state road made of steel and other surface is treated by how steep galvanized. Apart from that, it's strong and durable, usually given a lifespan of 20 years. Available in different forms in accordance with the specifications of the client. Small use includes fixing ground wires and conductors through zinc fittings or insulators. Apart from that, they are used to tower substation structures. This is done in accordance with the desired mounting ways and clamped constructions. How about stay loads? Stay loads use include a number of applications, including power transmissions, power accessories, and power distributions in power stations. The main material used in the manufacturing includes steel, metals, cast iron, carbon steel, among others. A steel road has two to go through following process before being zinc bladed or how deep galvanized finish. The process includes pressing, casting, rolling, forging, turning, mounting, drilling, and galvanizing. The next one is stay symbol. This is the third type of the ball type. Symbol stay symbol used in quite a number of applications and come in different forms. Among them is the wire well rope symbol made of carbon steels, LRAE steels to improve its strength and durability. It is used for fixing wire well ropes, marine hardware fittings, and chain fittings, among other applications. Surface treatment application includes electrical galvanization, hot deep galvanization, where others are painted in different colors, mostly silver, silver right. There are also many different styles depending on the specification of the customer and the intended use. So, the stay plate is also known as earth plate. It is a major, major component of Line technology with a wide range of users. It is fabricated using metal steel among other materials and hot dipped galvanized over a finished product. It is made a different size according to its intended use and customer specification. Another type of Stay road, do you remember? Oh yes, it's tubular tax. Under this category, we have the following types of stay road accessories. Turb and iron. Let's introduce it one by one. The turn buckles is a valuable three varieties with included. Turnbuckles I or I type. They are made of steel and 3D. It is also electrical galvanized to offer a smooth finish. It has two ends with holes known as the eye. Another available varieties is turnbuckle hooks or called 
hook tag that are made of steel and serrated on both sides. It is also passed through electrodonization to make it have a fine finish. Both ends have hooks that are used to attach to a different accessories. The third one is turnbuckle hooks or eye taps that are made of steel and threaded on the two ends. The two ends are different with one side having a hook and an eye on the other end. It has also been electrical galvanized to offer the perfect, perfect finish. And the arrow are made of steel and can either be hot, deep galvanized or electro galvanized to prevent corrosion. The hole at the one of its ends commonly referred to as the eye, thus the name the eye road. It is an important co component at the joints, making it flexible and easy to move. Let's move on to the next part, the part of materials. The materials used in making steel road is usually steel on, may, on many occasions, but there are other materials too. Other materials including alloy steel, cast iron, and carbon steel among other products. They are all offer great strength and are durable. The materials is expected to be strong enough to withstand different weather conditions depending on the area it is used. Corruption is a major problem when it comes to materials like steel and iron. To solve this problem, how deep galvanization or electro galvanization is done to the said materials. The durability of the stereo depends on the material used, so it has to be handled properly. How about the kind of steel? The kind of work performed by the stereo involves the applications of a lot of pressure on the road or the stay set. The materials used as to be strong enough to withstand the high pressure from way to high temperature. Do they have quality compliance? Of course, the com quality compliance is called ISO 1461. ISO 1461 is the standard you see in rating the quality of metals for particular use. It was prepared by a technical community, ISO, metallical and other ironical coatings. Under the sub-community, ISC4 has the coating. At the, moment, at the moment, the third edition is placed, consoling the second edition, with, which was technically revised. The revised version of ISO 1461 to 1999 reflects experience gain and includes a simple, simplified presentation of process, procedures. The changes in the new documents are outlined below. Fourthly, Refine scope of application of standards, including weld or wooden mesh products, which have been, which have been continuously galvanized. Additionally, of a definition of the wells page in the third clause. The thirdly, the third one of the outline is the. Availability of zinc supplied has brought about the addition of the reference. 
The first one is the section of coating finish has already been improved by adding more information and explanatory notes. The last one is the requirement for testing and sampling have also been made simple. And how about the process of making cereals? Depending on the type of materials used in making cereals, most of them usually to go through the same process. It is a very expensive method and mostly left for industrials to, to produce. The process is also very risky to be done at home and the product gear must be on at all times. Firstly, obtaining the re relevant raw materials used to make the cereals, for example, steel, iron, or alumina. The materials is then melted in a furnace to very high temperature, usually about 1200 degrees Celsius. Furnace temperature vary according to the materials being used. The melted materials is then channeled to different components, which will pro provide the specific shape and size. Most of the specifications are from the customers and the intended purpose. Apart from that, the specifications in making rows are usually computer-generated. After the desired structure has been achieved, it can be taken through other process to give it to the preferred design. It can be bent, hammered, put under a certain types or strength until it procedures the right form. A complete design is given the final touch by either hot deep galvanization or electric galvanization. It will give the materials a smooth finish with the design color. After the making, making process, how to install the steroid? Let's have a look. Steroids are installed differently in accordance to the purpose it was intended to perform. Since there are quite a number of steroids of different designs, the, usually is, the users is devised to get an installation menu. Apart from that, Installation should be left to professionals to perform as they are more experienced. The tubular and ball types of stereos go through the same procedure of installation. A very small part of the stereo is usually left out while the rest of it buried into the ground. Stereos are expected to be at an angle of 45 degrees to the horizon. At one end, there is a square road, and the other has between 130 to 300 millimeters length of street. Staples goes across the screws as the retract nuts face the staple. The square is based on the stay plate to increase the strength. Burning it in the ground will stop the head of the stay road from creeping. So, this is our topic today. The stay road. If you are interested in us, please subscribe at the right corner of our video. Thank you for your support. And if you are interested in our products, comment below and we will And we will contact you as soon as possible. So this is our today's topic. Let's have a review. What is a sale?
by my colleague Amanda. Thank you everyone for supporting. Subscribe us and contact us if you need the product.